we're ready to extrude our sample from the Shelby tube. We have a wax seal on the top that's meant to seal the moisture in once the sample has been taken out of the bucket. So we remove that, the wax seal by cutting around the edges with a razor blade. Um, Then we'll use our very high-tech specialized tool to pry underneath the wax seal. Pull it up. We're ready to place the Shelby tube into the extruding machine. There's a little shim piece in here that we want to make sure doesn't fall down as we put the sample in. So you have to kind of hold it in place while you push the shelf tube in the uh, tube extruder. Slide it all the way down until it's almost to the top. And then secure it in place using the large Allen wrench. So we're going to catch with one of these half shelby tubes and it's going to fall right there. And use the orange lever on the extruder to push the sample out. I'm going to catch the sample here in this shelby tube. <coughs> Out comes a sample.